Right, so I want to show you today a very good stretch I've discovered, um, actually been using it with a lot of my clients who actually have very tight um, stenocleidomastoid. This is one muscle here in front which is tight. If you're sitting in front of computer and kind of had, have like a forward head posture constantly, you'll find that this muscle is getting very tight. Also if your neck is not very, uh, if your neck is not arched properly or if you have a flat neck, then you also have a lot of tendency to feel pain in this area. So for that I'm going to show you this one particular stretch, very effective technique. To do this, you'll have to put your hands on your chest like this. The purpose of putting a hand on the chest is so you can pull down the fascia of your chest that connects directly to your neck, okay? So press it down. This is one muscle we call platysma. This muscle is kind of a fascia, right? If I show you here, if you take a look, this one. So we want to release this fascia and we want to hold it nicely in one position and then try and stretch the deep, very deep muscles in your neck and throat area. So interlock the finger, press the chest down, and then this is the movement you're going to do. You're going to lift the face up, but then once your face is up, once your face is up, you're going to create a small movement like this, like you're looking and nodding your head back and then nodding it to the left and then back and then to the right. Okay, so try about three times both ways. I'm going to show you this. I won't be able to talk much in this. So pressing down, lifting up. and release it back. You should try this one. This is very effective and you feel a deep stretch in here. For me, I've been doing it for a while, so this feels like just a very superficial stretch, but if you're starting out for the first time, you'll feel a very deep stretch in this area. So go ahead and try this particular exercise, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.